Floating Hospital grew out of the need to help young children who were either child laborers, immigrants, poor, the neediest. We were originally started in 1866 as the first pediatric charity. This is 150 years of service for the Floating Hospital. The rationale for having a ship was to get people out of crowded urban environments and help clear out their lungs. Healthcare at the time was milk, a bath, and fresh air. Healthcare as it evolved became vaccinations, it became aspirin, it became penicillin. The ship was magical. It really was. It was just an escape that our clients, our patients had. We were here providing this great quality care, medical, dental, but the kids were going on this boat ride, which for them was amazing. In 150 years, our mission has remained the same. We see whomever walks in the door, and we see them regardless of their ability to pay. Our largest patient base today are homeless families and families living in domestic violence safe houses. Floating Hospital's van service echoes its maritime history by going out, getting the patients, bringing them to the health care, exactly what we did with the ship. We have about 10 vans that we send out every day across all of the boroughs. The van service is crucial. If you're in a shelter, you are generally uprooted. You can be in a different borough. Being able to go to a case manager in a shelter and the case manager says, why don't you go to the Floating Hospital? They'll come get you. That makes all the difference in the world. The transportation is the big thing. Not too many clinics that I know of does that. I would say it gives them comfort. It gives them one less thing to worry about. Thank there you we so go. Much. You're Thank welcome. I came to Floating Hospital as being a victim of domestic violence. The man that attacked me was a boyfriend. There were dark secrets about him that I did not know. It led me down a horrific path. I was coming home from work. He grabbed me around my neck. I could feel my spine actually popping. And he pulled out an eight inch knife and he plunged it into me. When I came, I was a mess. I was a very fearful woman. I didn't want to speak to anybody. I didn't trust. I love the floating hospital. They have given me nothing but love. They have given me nothing but encouragement. Thank I am you. So proud of I am you. proud of myself. I'm moving forward, positive. I always told you that you could do it. The floating hospital and the therapists have set a platform for me. Okay, Beverly, this is your time to shine, to let the world know what you're made of. Five years go very fast, very but you have business. been doing very, very well. And of course, art has been a big part of your growth, but also your own mental health recovery. I love my art. <laughs> I love my art, yes. Floating Hospital is a healing platform for any woman or man that comes through their doors. <laughs>